the two presidents there, the presidents of Syria and Iran. And now I would like to invite President Bashar al-Assad to deliver his speech. I would like to thank my brother. I would like to thank my brother, the President, His Excellency, the President Mahmoud Ahmadinejad, after giving me this high ranking award in the name of the Iranian people and of the Iranian government. And I feel proud for having received this award or this medal because this reflects the level of the relations, the level where the relations have reached between Iran and Syria on all issues, in all different issues and on all levels. And in Syria, we cannot forget we cannot forget the Iranian stances which were taken in the previous decades, especially ever since the Islamic Revolution under the leadership of the late Imam Khomeini. We, we don't forget Iran's stance when it exchanged and replaced the Israeli embassy and turned it into a Palestinian embassy, an embassy for Palestine. We also don't forget when the Iranians decided, after the revolution, the Iranians decided to put Iran back in its natural stance, in its natural position in this region. I find and I feel that this medal and this award is an expressive appreciation because it's not only in the name of the government but in the name of Iranian people. This is an expression of the appreciation by the Iranian people because Syria stood side by side in support of Iran during many difficult periods. And during these periods many countries abandoned Iran and some of these countries even worked against Iran. And we cannot forget your stances today, your stances, the people and the government, your stances in support of the resistance in Palestine and in Lebanon. We can also not forget your stances in support of Gaza, which is under a siege. We cannot forget your support for the Arab causes and for the joint Muslim causes. And I believe that this medal and this award is an expression of appreciation because Syria stood side by side with those who were oppressed in Lebanon and in Gaza. These relations and the level of these relations which have been reflected by this award and by this gathering, this reflects a strategic relationship. Not because we made this decision, not because we decided for these relations to be strategic. However, because these relations are necessary relations for this region, the region of this Middle East. This strategic relationship is necessary for the independence and for the stability of the Middle East. These strategic relations are important for everyone, but they are not only for Iran and Syria and are not monopolized by Iran and Syria. We wish that all relations between the countries of the region are similar to the Iranian-Syrian relations. When we say that our relations are strategic and important for the Middle East, this does not mean that we monopolize these relations and we decide the future of such relations. All of these countries in the Middle East are important countries. However, the, the difference is that the alliance or the relations built between Iran and Syria are based upon the principle of independence and and will and independent decision making. This is what makes our relation or our ties unique. And the latest march towards independence in the Middle East, this will complete the relations or the ties which we begun with the late Imam Khomeini and with the President Bashar al-Assad, the late Syrian President Bashar Hafez al-Assad. And we will continue with this march as long as we possess the will. Once again, I would like to thank my brother, President Mahmoud Ahmadinejad, I would like to express my thanks to all Iranian citizens who stood side by side with those who were oppressed in the Arab and Islamic region. And we would like to take this opportunity once again to stress that we will continue with these ties, we will continue to promote this relationship for the sake of the people of both countries and for the sake of, 
of the region. I also would uh, like to wish the Iranian people more growth and uh, more progress, which will lead to more perseverance, and this will in turn open the road for more independence and more stability. And assalamu alaikum and thank you very much.